Yo, what is up, my dudes? This is Divine Plays, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Talk. So, uh, I I didn't really explain this in the first episode, which is kind of my bad. But uh, this series, Let's Talk, instead of Let's Play, it's Let's Talk. Get it? Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Anyways, <laughs> Let's Talk. It's just gonna be uh, uh, a series of me talking about just talking about games, cause. I don't know it's fun to play games but it's also fun to uh to talk about games <clears throat> and uh i do hope to bring on some friends of mine to talk about games too uh in the future but uh for now it's just me and uh yeah but for today's topic um i don't really know what else or what to talk about so i'm gonna do uh my i guess fun factor tier list for overwatch and this is just um this is going to be a tier list, not well, not really a tier list, but I guess tier list of me talking about which characters I find the most fun for me personally, uh, just to play. Not necessarily good at them, but just fun to play. So the way I have my tier list set up is I have really fun, fun, fun but gets boring fast, eh, and just simply no fun. And uh, I guess we'll start from let's start from the top really fun me personally i find sombra really fun um oh yeah and i, I probably should mention that these aren't in any specific order like for example sombra is not necessarily more fun than widow widow is not necessarily more fun than zen so on so on um but yeah anyways back to sombra <laughs> sombra i just find her fun because uh her invisibility allows you to just pretty much run around safe from uh enemy or enemy uh uh what am i saying enemy players targeting you um so yeah you just go invisible go back line or go to the enemy back line just start hacking fools and uh i don't know it's just fun to troll with her i guess <clears throat> next is widowmaker uh i just like snipers i'm not necessarily good with them but snipers are fun to play um I don't really, I don't think I have much else to say about Widowmaker. Um, it's so satisfying to get one shot headshots. Those are fun. Um, I don't know, that's all I got. <laughs> uh, next is Zen. Uh, Zen Yada, I just like his Discord. His Discord orb is really fun to use. It's like, especially when I'm flanked and I just boom, Discord orb, and then it gets the enemy hecka pressured. And I'm like, you better make your shots count. And but at the same time, I better make my shots count because uh, if I don't, then I'm dead. But if my shots are on point, mm, easy, easy one v one against flankers. Uh, and then his orb of harmony, it's just fun. Or what? Well, I mean, not necessarily fun, but it just makes it easy um, to to just throw the orb onto an ally, and then they'll just get consistent healing even though it's very small healing they get consistent healing and you don't have to worry about them um but yeah i'd say the the most fun thing about him is just his discord orb i really love using his discord uh his ult eh, not, not really much to say about his ult it's good but not really much to say about it in terms of uh having fun with it um sometimes his very slow movement speed can get annoying, but I mean, it's whatever. Uh, next is Genji. Uh, Genji, he is, he's fun to mess around with. Extremely hard hero to use and to master, but super fun to just mess around with. Uh, his dash, uh, wall climbing, his double jump, um, just spamming shurikens from the back line or I don't know, front line, whatever. Um, I don't know, Genji's just really fun. But again, super difficult to play and master but super fun to play um next is bridget uh me personally i like to use melee uh like stout characters um even though like bridget and reinhardt i'm not necessarily good with them but they are fun to use um bridget i like her healing even though it's much worse than compared to how she was originally uh, or before the change but I don't know it's just something about regen effect that just I don't know it just intrigues me I don't know why but it's just fun 
It's like, here, have your regen. <laughs> here, have your regen. Uh, I don't know. She's just fun for me. Next is Anna. Um, she's just another sniper that also plays the role of support. Um, I guess the main reason why I like her or why I think she's fun is just because of her nano boost. Uh, again, like I said in my in the first episode of Let's Talk, I was talking about my Overwatch mains. Um, or the segment where I was talking about my Overwatch mains. Anna is one of my support mains. And the reason was because it's just so fun to have the power to nano boost someone or nano boost an ally and basically give them the power or give them the power to go Super Saiyan. <laughs> so that's that's literally the only reason why. Um, but yeah, she's fun just because of her nano boost. I like her nano boost. Uh, Junkrat. Uh, he's just fun to use. Spam shots. That's all you do. Spam shots. Uh, mind jump to places or yeah just mind jump to places and stuff like that uh throw out your uh your trap um on capture the flag modes junkrat's really fun to play uh because you just put the <laughs> put his trap on the uh uh on the flag and then people run into it a lot instead of destroying it uh so yeah next is hanzo hanzo he's just basically another sniper uh but with a bow and arrow uh, honestly, he's really fun to play too, but I don't know. Uh, I just don't find myself playing him too much, but he is fun. It's so satisfying when you get headshots with him. Um, his alt is kind of weird, but I don't know. That's just me. I would love to try out his, um, I think it was his scatter arrow. I think that's what it was. The one where he shoots one arrow and then kind of just shoot bounces a bunch of arrows all over the place. I would love to have tried that, but I started playing Overwatch uh, after they got rid of it. Um, but yeah, I, w I would love to see how that or how that worked. But uh, yeah, Hanzo, he's fun. I like it. Next is Reinhardt. Basically, same reason as Bridget. He's a pretty much he's a melee fighter in uh, in the game. It's fun to use his charge. I use his charge a lot. Um, <laughs> like especially on Hanamura, uh, the like when we're on attack, I just freaking charge directly towards the point, and uh, for some reason it works. Like it works almost every time. I have like a ninety percent success rate on Hanamura with Reinhardt. Uh, it's like just that first point though. Um, I don't know why it works, but it works. So yeah, Reinhardt pretty fun uh next we got just the regular old fun so torb is here um he is one of my dps mains but the thing is that his playstyle can get kind of boring to me at least um i love his turret don't get me wrong i love using his turret and uh, I, I just love characters in general like in games that can like summon their own uh like deployables or pets or something to fight with them and Torb's turret is really fun to use uh, it's really fun to place and set up um, but I don't know it's just his play style in general it just kind of gets boring for me after after a while um, but I don't know Torb just love his turret uh, I think to this day I would probably enjoy him a little bit more if he still had his um, his old ability to give armor to his teammates. I think I'd probably enjoy him a little bit more, but like in terms of fun factor, but because they took that out, made him more DPS built instead of support. Uh, I guess some of his fun factor kind of died out a little bit for me, but uh, I don't know. He's all right. Next is Mercy. Mercy, she's fun just because like when I'm not, I'm not in the mood to like do crazy stuff. Uh, and be like super serious I can just use mercy and just kind of just keep my healing on the teammate or just damage boost um, glide away to escape she's fun to use when I want like just an easy game pretty much just just to have an easy easy game less stressful or non-stressful game but after a while it does like I said it does kind of get eh, just same old same old um, 
And when things start to become same old, same old, that's when I switch characters. Next is Orissa. Orissa, she's one of my tank mains. Um, she's fun. I think I find her fun, but uh, kind of the same reasons why, or kind of the same reasons I said in the uh, in the first episode of Let's Talk. It's just her gravity or graviton orb or whatever is it's called. I just can't utilize it uh, to the best of its uh, abilities. Or did that make sense? I just can't use it well. Um, so sometimes using Orisa can kind of get a little annoying, frustrating. Uh, but overall, I think she's pretty fun. Next is Symmetra. I just like her. Same reason for Torb. Set up turrets. That's about it. <laughs> Uh, I do like the uh, the change they made to her teleporter that it doesn't destroy on its own and that it just stays out on the field until you manually destroy it or until uh, the opponent or the enemy destroys it. Uh, so I think that's pretty cool. Moira, she's just, I don't know, she's fun to play every now and then. Um, it's just... When I need to, or like when I need to play a strong healer, she's fun to just have. Like she's kind of like my secondary, uh, laid back support. Kind of just toss my healing orbs, just spam heals. Uh, and then if the enemy team has a Genji, it's that's when Mora begins to be really fun. It's like try to deflect this Genji. Next is Lucio. Uh, mainly just because of the wall riding, or yeah, the wall riding. That's ba that's literally all it is. Next is the new hero, Echo. Um, I don't really know where to put her because I haven't played her too much yet. But the times that I did play her, she's not bad. Um, I think if I play her a little bit more and get used to her, I think I could. I think she could go up to really fun. Um, but for now, she's just that fun because I don't play her too much. I don't play the game too much anymore. Uh, so yeah, she's just here. Next is Bastion. Bastion's fun when you get to set up and then you just spam bullets and just take out like the enemy team one by one. Uh, it's so satisfying when you see the kill cam or not kill cam, kill feed and then um, you just see like your your name and then you're killing this person, this person, this person, this person. Um, but then when there's no enemy team like they're just hiding around buildings and stuff like that and you can't find anybody then it starts to get a little boring uh, but that's probably just the me thing next is doomfist uh he's fun to play i'm not necessarily good with him um i'd say i'm pretty trash with him but it's fun to just, it's fun to do his sure you can and then hulk smash uh one punch um yeah, he's just a fun character to use but I i'm trash with him uh, next is Roadhog uh, getting or landing his hook and try, trying to get his one shot like if I can get his one shot uh, it's pretty fun to use him but most of the, most of the time I can't land that headshot so um, I don't know but he's, he's pretty fun to use just mainly because of his hook next is fun but gets boring fast Tracer I like using Tracer uh, being able to just kind of zip around uh, my enemies um, but I'm trash with Tracer um, so she gets born fast because I'm trash <laughs> May she's easy to use and she is kind of fun to just freeze in the headshot um, but I don't know to me personally that gets kind of boring fast uh, so yeah that's why she's here next is soldier which is kind of that normal Call of Duty type character so I don't know not much to say about him Winston, he's fun. I actually started, uh, well, not started, but I actually have uh, taken an interest into Winston's character. Um, I don't know. It's just his the thing that makes it boring for me is that his damage, uh, or I guess the reason why he's here is because his damage is so weak, so it kind of frustrates me a little bit, so that's why he's here. Um, so I guess instead of getting boring quickly, it's more like fun, but frustrates the heck out of me quickly <laughs> uh next is sigma sigma is one of my tank mains as i said in the uh 
the previous episode. Um, but Sigma... I mean, maybe it's just... Maybe I'm just playing him wrong, but... He just seems very repetitive. Um, just hold out your shield, spam shots. Um, and then he's got his... Um, his... I guess his field... Like, his shield thing. I don't know what it's called. Uh, where he can just absorb uh, projectiles. And turns it into shields. Which is pretty cool. But... I don't know, Sigma as a character overall just gets so boring to me. Next is Baptiste. I mean, I like his I like his character, I like his healing, but oh my goodness, he gets boring so quick. To me personally, he just gets so boring so fast. His ult is not even that good. Um, I don't know, he's just so boring. He gets so boring. Uh, like at the beginning of the game, it's fine. He's, he's pretty cool pretty chill but then like i said mid to late game he starts to get really boring um but yeah i don't know next is eh. ash the only reason why she's not in no fun is mainly because of bob i love using uh, her ult but using her character in general oh i hate it i can't play her i can't get uh the feel for her and she just oh, i don't know she's just boring to me I guess next is McCree uh, he's alright like I, I could play him for a little bit but then I'd have to switch fairly quickly Reaper he's not bad I mean when I'm doing work with him then it's you know it's kind of fun it pro he'd probably be fun but gets boring fast but I don't play Reaper a whole lot so he's in eh Diva, I love her character in general, but I can't play her character. Like her role and her playstyle, I can't play. That's just that's just not me. It's not my style. <laughs> Zarya, I just like her bubbles. That's it. Um, everything else is kind of eh. I, I can't play her. Um, that's it. Hamster, uh, it's just fun to go into his ball form and just kind of roll around and then swing around. That's literally it. That's that's it. Everything else is kind of into me. And then no fun, Farah. Farah, like the times I have fun with her, is very rare. Overall, she's just so boring. <laughs> uh, I mean, it does take a lot of skill to actually learn how to utilize her her flying or her flight a little bit better um but i don't know i just can't play her i don't find her that interesting i mean before before i got into overwatch i thought she was going to be one of my main dps characters or yeah characters but um yeah that turned out to be the opposite she's like one of my least favorite characters to play uh i don't know she's just not fun to me that's that's really about it so, uh, that's going to be it for this video. Um, like I said, this series is just going to be me talking about games. Uh, hopefully, bring friends to talk about games with me. Uh, but we'll see how, how that happens. We'll see what happens. I'll have to figure out some topics to talk about. Um, but, uh, yeah. Hopefully you, guys, hopefully, you guys can hear my dog in the background. Making too much noise. But anyways, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave this video here. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. I would really appreciate it. And uh, if you guys enjoyed my content or, or enjoyed what you guys saw, maybe consider subscribing to the channel. And uh, this is Divine Place, and I'm out. Peace. I hit my mic.